Only qualified personnel should service and install HVAC appliances and accessories. See product manual for details. This video will demonstrate how to select a correct location for a ductless heat pump. The following tools are recommended to have on hand when installing an HVAC appliance. A drill and hole saw, screw gun, ratchet tube bender, level, spring bender, tape measure, 3 16 and 5 16 Allen keys, tube cutter, Phillips screwdriver, adjustable wrenches, wire strippers, flaring tool, refrigeration scale, thermometer, refrigeration gauges and fittings, 1 quarter inch to 5 16 inch adapter, the product manual, torque wrench, vacuum pump, nitrogen, refrigerant, and all appropriate PPE. Begin the installation by determining the best location for both the indoor and outdoor units. It is recommended that the outdoor portion of the heat pump be placed on a stand or wall mounted. Ensure the location has good air circulation and ventilation, has a firm foundation that can support the unit and will not vibrate. The location must not be near any obstacles that may block air inlets or outlets and must be protected from prolonged periods of direct sunlight, heavy winds, and excessive rainfall. If installation is taking place in an area where significant snowfall is anticipated, take measures to prevent ice buildup and coil damage. Avoid areas that are near sources of combustible gas, flue gases, drier exhaust vents, salty air, or excessive dust. Regardless of the mounting method selected, follow all clearances listed in the manual. For the indoor portion of the system, determine which room or rooms, if using a multi-zone system, where the indoor heads will be installed. Ensure each location is at least one meter from all other electrical devices, has good air circulation, convenient drainage, and is strong enough to support the unit and prevent vibration. The location should not be in direct sunlight and should not be exposed to unconditioned air, as this will affect temperature readings and overall system operation. In addition, the location should not be near any source of steam, heat, or combustible gas and must not be installed near flammable items or doorways. All indoor units must follow the clearances listed in the manual to ensure the system can operate as intended. If using a multi-zone system, ensure you refer to the product manual for the maximum number of units and capacities allowable with each outdoor unit. Each outdoor unit has specific indoor head combinations, which must be used to maintain efficiency and correct operation. Click here to view the Wolf Steel Technical YouTube page. Like and subscribe to our channel to get notifications for new product and troubleshooting videos.